All right. Good morning, everyone. Uh, my name is Ted Phillips. I'm the chair of the JEA's award committee, and I would like to call to order the September 12th, uh, 2024 awards meeting to order. Uh, we have a physical forum pre present this morning, represented by myself, David Emanuel, and Hai Vu, who is here representing for uh, Renetta Marshall. OGC is represented by Rebecca Levy, and budget is represented by Stephanie Neely. Um, we do have two, two guests with us this morning. Welcome. Uh, uh, would either one of y'all like to make a public comment? No, no. you're the talker. <laughs> All right. Um, Sarah, did, did we receive any um, uh, comments via email? No public comments. All right. Is there anyone on the call this morning uh, 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 from the public who would like to uh, make a public comment? If so, uh, please unmute yourself and speak up. Hearing none, we'll move on. On today's consent agenda, we have items one through four. They have been uh, approved by procurement budget, OGC, legal, the business unit, VP and chief, and are ready for the awards committee approval. Award item number five is being deferred. Uh, before we take a vote on the consent agenda, is there anyone on the committee who would like to uh, move an item to the regular agenda for discussion or uh, defer an item to another week? Item number we have a question. We can. So we we will uh, move item number three to uh, the regular agenda. So um, I would entertain a uh, motion to approve items one and two and four on the consent agenda. So move. Second. So that was David with the uh, motion and high with the second. All those in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? Hearing none, the motion is adopted. Uh, we will move to the regular agenda. So item one on the regular agenda is uh, a contract uh, with water and wastewater project support with Kingville, is, did I pronounce that correctly? Uh, Enterprises? Kevil, excuse me, thank you. Kevil Enterprises, uh, this is for uh, construction management, project management, scheduling, cost analysis, estimates, safety support, and other job functions. Uh, my question on this was, is this for a specific project or projects? And if so, can we get those uh, uh, put into the record. So, my name is Dan Crook. I purchasing. Uh, it they touch most of the capital projects that the um, project engineering team in water wastewater handles. So it's a large portion of the the capital uh, bucket uh, capital projects on the water wastewater side. Uh, especially on this on the um, scheduling and um, uh, cost specialist side, they, they handle they touch most of the projects. If I may, Dan, yes. there are supplemental staff and they are assigned to projects. It's being necessary by the team, so we don't we don't have specific projects because they may change. Okay, they're yeah. just they're two just entities. Okay. Slow. And, and, and so maybe just a little bit. So, so why are we needing an extra three million dollars? Is it just because of the uh, workload? Yes, sir. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Uh, is there anyone else that has any questions on item number one? Okay, that answered my question. So, uh, I would entertain a motion. Uh, so moved. Second. So that was high with the motion, David with the second. All those in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? Hearing none, the motion is adopted. So we will move to item number two, which uh, uh, 
uh, was for the uh, Mayapple pump station upgrade. Um, I noticed we only received one bid on this project and was wondering if we could get a little bit more uh, information on why we only received one bid. Yes, that's Dan Crook again. Um, so you've attempted to bid this uh, product out a couple of times and then received low or no participation each time. Uh, a large part, uh, factor in that is uh, the timing of one of the portions of it is the some pipes that have to be dug out across. I think it's um, Merrill Road. Merrill Road, yeah. yeah. It, 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 they're gravity lines, so they have to be dug very deep, and it can only be done during the summer while school's out, uh, and that affects the timing for the company. So it's staffing uh, levels is, is is a problem uh, for a lot of them. Uh, so that, at least that's the feedback that we got. So um, that was a fact. That portion of the job was a, was a big factor for a lot of companies. But 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 we feel like the eight million is is a fair price. Yes, sir. It was okay. it was very close to our estimate. Okay. okay. Thank you. That answers my question. Anybody? Okay. All right. So I'd entertain a motion on item number two. So move. Second. So that was David with the motion and Hi with the second. All those in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? Hearing none. Uh, award number two on the regular agenda is adopted. So we will go back to uh, consent agenda item number three, which will now be regular agenda item number three. Uh, uh, so, um, uh, you, you had a question on this one? Yes, sir. I do have a question on the history of the approvals. It seems to me, I, I gather that the amendments were a combination of administrative increases and um, award committee uh, approvals. And I've assumed that, well, let's say this, 12 days ago, there was an increase of $40,000. And now we're coming to the committee with an increase of $80,000. Just wanted to know a little bit of more history on, the, on that. I'll take that. My, my name okay, is Maria you. Benavides. Hello? Yeah, go ahead. Thank you, Maria. Yeah, so hi, Boo. The total amount of the of the needed, that was needed to complete the implementation of ECE was 120,000. We did not have enough CPA, so we issued the first part of the PO for the 40,000, and we're coming back to awards for the remaining CPA. So that's the discrepancy. It's not that it's, you know, we needed this amount and then we needed another amount. We knew from the get-go that the total amount was um, 120,000. Does that make sense? It, it, it does, and others may disagree, but it is my opinion that when we have a situation like that, we go in front of the awards committee for the entire amount instead of parsing it out. That's, and that's and I point. understand, but the, but this is a precarious need. So we we upgraded the IVR system to a new version. And unfortunately, the new version of ECE, which is what provides the ability for uh, our agents to use um, email, um, was not upgraded at the same time. It posed a great deal of technical challenges. We are trying our very best to close that gap, especially for the commercial team, so then they can be on the new um, ECE version because they're having to do a lot of extra work. And so uh, we wanted the vendor to provide the, 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 the functionality as quick as possible. And if we were to wait for the awards, we would have lost two weeks of the work. Um, and so that was why we made the decision to issue the first part of the PO for the amount that we could get the vendor going and then come back and issue the remaining of the PO in that manner. Yeah, I can certainly understand the challenges of getting the work done, but 
what I understand is there was a scope of $120,000 before August 30th. And then we decided 40,000 it has to be done, but there were opportunities for the works committee before today. I, yeah. I, so I want to say this, I, I think it is not good practice to separate out a, a full scope into different um, portions. I, I think if you have a, a scope change, just strive to get it done. It, if it, you know, if it's past the uh, administrative amount, it should go through the Wars Committee in its entirety. That, that's my I, I think you make a very good point, Ha, and, and, and so uh, uh, in the future, let, let, let's let's work to try to, to you know, uh, uh, do what we can do to make this uh, 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 one bite at the apple instead of multiple. We'll do, Ted, and if it wasn't an emergency, we would absolutely opted for that but unfortunately it's not fast to get into the award agenda as well and um yeah but yeah I understand Duly noted. thank you thank you any other questions on item number three i'll entertain a motion so moved second so we have motion by hi the second by david uh all those in favor say aye aye, aye. any opposed Hearing none, motion is adopted. So uh, today, uh, items one and two and four of the consent agenda uh, uh, have been approved. Item five was deferred. And then items one through three of the regular agenda have been approved. Is there any other business to come before the awards committee this morning? Hearing none, uh, we are adjourned. Thank you to our guests for coming this morning. And uh, thank you for everyone for your hard work. Uh, stay safe out there. Uh, we've got a few more days of rain still left with this. So thank you. So thank the, you. The award for thank the janitor. you. Was, was it one of those that was delayed? Let's see. Uh, let's see, we have the reclaim with item two, professional service. Ted, is this something you want recorded or do you want it off?